Well, this program is on communication, indestructible communication, an absolute cornerstone of every good marriage. And Karen, we have some questions from our viewers. Okay, how do you make meaningful communication a bigger priority in your marriage? Well, uh, to communicate, you know, this is something, Karen, when we first got married that you wanted to talk all the time. You wanted to talk about your feelings. <laughs> and, uh, feelings. Feelings. <laughs> and, uh, and I didn't want to. I thought you were nosy and I didn't want to feed the monster. Mm -hmm. And so, uh, but, but you wanted it. And so finally I decided, uh, I, I really did. I decided that I would do that. Mm -hmm. Well, I love it. I mean, it really is something today we both enjoy. And I, I mean, I, I want to do that. Mm -hmm. it, it's important. But, but let, me, let me go back for just a minute about making communication important in your marriage. You know, this is something that men just need to understand is a huge need for their wives. Yes. And what it means is every day mm -hmm. having undistracted time to talk, mm -hmm. where you talk face to face, where you don't have your phone in front of you, you don't have a television, you don't have you know, kids around, mm -hmm. but you sit down face to face and it's a discipline. It's not something that might happen, mm -hmm. it's something that happens. Mm -hmm. It's the most controllable part of your day, which might be early or it might be late. But, but every day you have that communication. Well, you know I communicate throughout the day. I mean, mm -hmm. we're really good about you know, either on the phone and, and we don't just say, hi, you know, I'm here, da, da, da. We talk, you know, like mm -hmm. what just happened or what even, what's been going on. So we keep um, short accounts of what's going on in our life because we're talking constantly through the right. day. But, but you're think, right. I think it's one of the most enjoyable parts of, of life. Uh -huh. and, and honestly, I, I would have never said that before because I was a typical guy that just didn't think I needed that. Well, and but, when, it, but it's fantastic. Well, when we were dating, you were a great communicator. I mean, so... I was faking it. <laughs> no, you're a good communicator. <laughs> yeah. And, um, you know, it's funny though because it's like anything else when you get married. Sometimes you, you stop doing the things right. that we were, you know, so good at. Yeah. So that's good. Okay, what if the only way a wife can get her husband to communicate for any length of time is to have sex with him first? And the problem is... I was going to say, I knew you were going to say that. <laughs> well, I knew you were going to say that. It's, it's a trade-off. And, and no, you, the, that husband, that <laughs> no. husband shouldn't you know, do that. I, I kind of agree, too. You know, no. it's like, whatever. But, but what, I, what, what I would say is we're, we have different needs. And one of a man's most important needs is sex. And one of a woman's most important needs is open and honest communication. Mm -hmm. And I think it's a trade-off. And I think that a, a man should patiently, uh, lovingly communicate with his wife. And, and a wife should meet her husband's sexual needs, well, but it doesn't need to, it doesn't need to be something that you force your spouse right. to communicate, you know, before they get sex or force them to have sex before you communicate. Right. You, you serve each other. Well, this is what you did with our, our marriage. I mean, it's kind of reverse where you said, you know, we're going to sit down and we're going to have the one-on-one -on -one communication. And then, you know, everything else was really good. It helped. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, that's right. That's good. Okay, when my spouse and I have a free moment to talk, I feel like my husband is just going through the emotions. One of us often wants to talk, but the other is distracted or tired. Well, that, that goes back to, uh, and, and based on her question there, uh, I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to kind of direct this toward him and say she's wanting to talk, mm -hmm. but he's distracted or tired or whatever. Put away distractions. No television, nothing else. Well, it's like I always say, hello. You know, you can, you can sit there and nod your head yes, but we all know if you're really with us. You know? <laughs> <laughs> well, the husband needs to turn. First of all, watch your wife when she's doing this in front of your face. Early, really and truly, I used to sit at the dinner table with our family, mm -hmm. and I would come in from work, and I mean, I was just still at work in my mind. And I would just kind of wake up at the dinner table and the whole family would be staring at me. You know, and, it, and he I, thought he was being a, a part of the family. Like, yeah. <laughs> I thought because since I was physically there, yeah. that's what mattered. But I was not, I was not mentally and emotionally engaged. there. Right. You were engaged. And so what she's wanting is not just his physical presence mm -hmm. or just, you know, uh, a, a superficial conversation. She wants his heart. Mm -hmm. And that's what every man needs to understand. She's never going to, she's not going to be satisfied until she feels like, you're engaged, you're energetic, and you're you're being completely honest. And she's getting the real you. Mm -hmm. uh, and that's that, I mean, it's a real deep need that women have that men need to understand. That's good. My wife has a mouth on her. Ooh, how can ooh, how can she understand that I don't want to talk when she uses harsh words and shares with everybody? This okay. I'm going to answer this from a man's perspective and say number one need of a man is respect. To successfully communicate with a man, you have to use a tone of respect. It's our biggest need. We're very sensitive in that area. You can be saying everything right with the wrong tone. We hear the wrong tone. 
Okay, you don't like me, you don't believe in me, you're being aggressive with me, whatever. Number one. Number two, he said she tells everybody. Women are, are physically modest and emotionally immodest. Mm -hmm. Okay, Men are physically immodest and emotionally modest. Mm -hmm. We don't talk like women talk. Right. You'll hear a group of women talking, and oh, they talk about everything. Mm -hmm. You know, and just that we never talk about that kind of stuff. It just it embarrasses us. Men talk about trucks, you know, sports. What'd you kill last, last Dallas weekend? Cowboys. The Dallas Cowboys. <laughs> we talk superficial stuff. You don't hear Bob, you know, guys saying, well, Bob, how do you feel about that? You know, and it, we don't care. We just don't care how you feel about it. Is So when, when she takes the, the private lives of their marriage and takes it outside, He's going to clam up as tight as he can be. So I'm, I'm going to say, I'm, I'm sure she has a side to this story. But I'm going to say, since he asked the question, it would be very helpful for he says she has a mouth on her. Okay. <laughs> well, you know what it is, too. What? She didn't like to be, he doesn't like to be talked to like he's the child. And what happens in those situations, right. the woman starts talking to him like, you know, stop. Uh, 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 and it's yeah. like, oh, my gosh. That's so right. That's right. That's exactly right. We don't want to be, we may act like children. We don't want to be treated. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Thank you for joining us. Experience the life-changing series, The Indestructible Marriage, on CD or DVD. Looking for your next great book? Start reading instantly with Marriage Today's eBooks, now available online. Follow your interests and get social by connecting with Jimmy and Karen and the Ministry of Marriage Today on Twitter. Become a rock-solid partner today and equip yourself with the tools you need for a successful marriage. $14, $28, or $56 per month. Choose the partnership level that's right for you. Become a rock-solid partner today.